Welcome to lab 100. In this lab, we're going to get started with OAC. We're going to create an instance, and we're going to get acclimatized with the DV interface. <clears throat> we're going to start by going to the cloud.oracle.com website. You can click the sign in button at the top. This will take you to the cloud account page. Now enter your cloud credentials for your account and hit the blue My Services button. Enter your username in the username field. Enter the password in the password field. And when you're finished, hit the Sign In button below that. Now we're going to configure our home dashboard. Click the Customize Dashboard button and scroll down to where you see Autonomous Analytics. Ensure that Automatic is shown so that it always shows up in the home dashboard. Now click on the hamburger menu in the upper left hand corner and go to Services and Autonomous Analytics. Next, we're going to create an instance. Go over and hit the Create Instance button. This will take you to the Instance Configuration page. Over Feature Set, we're going to change Business Intelligence in the drop-down menu to Data Visualization. Next, over an instance name, go ahead and give it the name OAC Workshop. We're now going to configure the license type. Go down to subscribe to a new Autonomous Analytics Cloud Software License radio button and select that. Finally, we're going to change the edition to Standard Edition. Once you're finished with that, hit the Next button in the upper right hand corner. This will take you to the confirmation page. Ensure everything's right, then hit Create. This will now take you to the confirmation screen. Once the status goes from creating service to a screen where you see the details of the instance, that means you're all set. We're now going to access our OAC instance. You can do this by clicking on the ellipses and then hitting Oracle Analytics Cloud URL. This will take you to the OAC homepage. Here, you can click on the hamburger menu in the top left. This will open the drawer menu. Here, you can see the home button, which is the page we were just at. This is where the existing projects, data sets, and data flows are. Projects is where the collections of visualizations and underlying data lies. Data allows you to create data flows, create data sets, and also connections. Machine learning allows you to create machine learning models for use in projects. Console is for managing some of the, the backend um, aspects of it. And finally, Academy is where some important links lie to OAC documentation. We're now going to explore the Create button. This is where you can create projects, data sets, and connections, data flows, and sequences. And it's really a central part to starting a project. But now we're going to select the hamburger menu to the right of create. And here you can select customize this page. This menu allows you to customize the components of the home page. But we're going to keep that as is. Now that you've created your instance in OAC and have started that up and know your way around the UI a little bit, Let's get on to Lab 200, and here you can get started on some analysis.